Hello, this is Ben Brownlee from Curious Turtle, and we're going to be looking at the BCC Optical Stabilizer Filter. This filter lets us stabilize out shaky footage very, very quickly using optical flow technology to get us a nice, smooth shot. So let's take a look at how this works. Here's our original shot, bouncing around all over the place. And let's turn on the BCC Optical Stabilizer. Now, the first thing it's going to ask us to do is to analyze the shot. But before we do that, we're going to set up a region of where we're going to be looking. Now, obviously, I don't want to have the letterboxing within this frame, but I can also limit the region to just one area over here to define what it is we're going to be looking at. And this could be very useful because we want to define here an area that's as large as possible, but also doesn't have any untrackable objects, such as a large amount of blank sky or moving water, that type of thing. Once we have our region set up, we can also come in to have a look at the motion vectors. And if you've worked with the optical flow filter, you can adjust these settings in the same sort of way. But we're not going to look at that right now. I'm just going to come in and say stabilize. So now I can click to analyze my motion. And the BCC optical stabilizer will have a little think, analyze my motion, and give us our result. If we look back in the effect, at the moment we're just stabilizing out translation, but we can stabilize translation translation, rotation, or translation, rotation, and zoom. In this case, we only need to take out the rotation. And we can see that's nice and stable. If I didn't want to have this as a completely static shot, if I wanted to maintain some of the original motion, but wanted to take out the shakiness, then instead of stabilize, I can also use smoothing. And with smoothing, I can set up my smoothing range the higher the range, the more stable it's going to be. And if I bring this down very low, we're almost getting no smoothing at all. So with the smoothing turned on, we've got a much smoother shot that still maintains some of its life. If I open up post-processing, I can turn off auto scale and scale this image up to take away my letterbox borders. I can also choose the quality of this scale moving from this zoom in a little bit so you can see the difference here, moving from draft to fast to sharp, standard, smooth, magic smooth, and my favorite, magic sharp. And if we check out the compare mode, I can have a look at these side by side. You can see what a huge difference the BCC optical stabilizer has made for us. Thanks for watching, and be sure to click on the link in the description to download a free trial of Continuum for Adobe and check it out for yourself. Also, follow Boris FX on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter to stay up to date with the latest information and training materials on Continuum, Sapphire, Mocha Pro, and all the Boris FX products.